Hello everyone, welcome back to another video for me, peace of my name. And today in that video, I want to talk about the resource healing, conquest achievements in your personal tab and how you can get them pretty easily done for kind of really low resources. And for that, one member in 93HH have calculated everything. We're going through that, how much resource cost do we have? How much resource do we get back? How much other stuff do we get? And I think when we coming to this quest there, which you see, we're going to talk about the elixir which, you grant, uh, which you're getting here from. And as you see, we have like three quests and we're getting a good amount of stuff. Like this is, this is 50, 20 K elixir potion. So it's really, really a lot. So let's jump into the message from that member. All right, guys, here we are. And in the background, you see where the message. So I'm gonna read it out loud firstly, and then we're gonna go go through it a little bit. So the achievement resource here, one minute unit, etc., up to 10 million if you do it with donkeys. It will cost you 160 million wood and 160 million gold for 10 million. 320 million combined. The rewards you get completing all. So we're talking about the four rewards uh, or four conquests hints which you saw there. We're getting one million elixir, 13 gold keys, 10 silver keys, 90 million gold, 19 or 19.5 million gold, 19.5 million wood, 11.58 million or 3.5 million mana. So that's a total of 59, uh, sorry, 54 million combined plus one extra ember. The value for one elixir is worth depending on your T level and unit type. I have the four and mage, uh, main mage. 114 wood, 86 ore, 38 mana. So that is 140 million wood, 86 million ore, 38 million mana, 238 million combined. The value for one main elixir is hard to set due to its value in combat. I have only focus on its resource value and if you never resource here, it has only merit value. One gold key is valued at 600 gems without discount. 1,500k gold wood is valued 275 gems. 13 gold keys value 4.25 main resources. One silver key is valued at 300 crystals without discount. Again, the same um, gems. And then 10 silver keys value 1.635 main resources. So you earn from rewards. 297, 966 million resources and value, meaning you pay 22.034 million gold wood for the one extra ember. You need to calculate your elixir value for yourself. I do believe it'd be worth for OT5. Conclusion, a draw your own, but I'm gonna start killing off donkeys. I really would like to have one main elixir extra for the zone five war and the, uh, and the gems is worth much more crystals or the crystal right um yeah so that is it basically oh why are we doing the video <laughs> Bo, thank you very much for the subscription maybe you see that video hey shout out to you bro thank you very much for the subscription um yeah so i think if you're talking about that and really analyzing the conquest achievement and what we're getting in terms of um it is really worth to probably to do so um because you're getting like the one main extra elixir, right? Sure, it's gonna cost you the gold and wood, but I mean, to be honest, gold and wood is pretty easily to farm and you can also share it around, right? And on top of that, you're also getting then the, some keys and the one extra amber, which is gonna lead you to getting, you know, a skip. So um, my personal opinion, do I think this is, this is worth? So, I think, I think if you're killing it off with donkeys, it might be not as much worth as if you would resource anyway in the world. And here's the thing, right? Sure, you're getting one million el elixir and some other stuff, but it's gonna cost you 320 million resources. So 160 million wood and gold. That is a lot, especially for T4, right? Like alone, if you're having a look alone, the Horde of Order cost me 72 million gold and 72 million wood. It is basically half 
of the cost from what I have to pay for the whole of all, right? I do think it is worth for the T5, right? I'm going to show you a screenshot of my current resources, which I have just in my bag on my main account. And there you see, I have like millions of resources there. I'm, I'm, by the time I'm getting on 293, I'm probably going to have a billion gold and wood. So I do think 45, it is worth, but I do not think it is worth for the T4 players, right? Because of the fact that we, that we needing these resources for Alpha doing buildings or technology, and it is all cost us. And then also we need to train, right? Um, if it's now a T4.5, so someone who have done all buildings and basically only needing the last military tax, like the last levels of the military tax, which cost like 100 days, 60 days, 40 days, that type of stuff. I do think for you is also worth. But everyone below who needs to done building, like I did myself on my second account, um, or who don't have yet the technology that high that you don't care about resources anymore. I do think when for all these people who have done that already and for the T5, that is definitely worth to do so. And I mean, you can, I think you can easily up to 600k per, he per day hear that. And yeah, so if you're not resourcey at all and just doing that donkey thing, what uh, Moody said here, totally worth 45 and T4.5, who are like almost done with technology. Um, if you're now obviously resourcey anywhere in a war, yeah, then perfect. Then it is literally perfect because you're getting on top of the point that you don't care at all about the resources anyway, right? Because you're using it for resource healing. On top of that, you're getting the one main elixir and the other stuff and the Ictra Amber. So that is pretty interesting to see the calculation done. So shout out to Moody here from 93HH. Thank you, bro, for calculating and writing it down there and basically also showing it for everyone. And yeah, so let me know in the comments what you guys think about that. And let me know if you agree with my opinion about that or not. And if you have any questions to what the conquest achievement, make sure to join my stream because I'm going to answer there all your questions. Make sure to hit the like button if you enjoy the content. Make sure to subscribe to the channel if you are new to the channel. We, I saw we have around 60 to 70% of the viewers not subscribed. So make sure to cl uh, click that subscribe button. We are on the way to getting 1k subs here, guys. So... Please help me out on that. I wish you all guys a great rest of the day. Have a great start. Even the next day. Stay happy, everyone. I love you all. Thank you all for your support. It's amazing. And yeah, I'm out. We see us on the next one.